this is what my daddy told me about myself. This is what he told me. Because guess what? He's not here right now, right? He's not here right now, right? So this is what he told me. This is what he told me. And I'm, I'm repeating it back because obviously we got in a fight. And when we get in a fight, I repeat all the awful things he said to me about myself. But I didn't want to tell anybody. And I'm just make it look like I'm thinking it. It's my thoughts. It's my thoughts. <sighs> Don't you get it? Don't you get it? Except actually, he doesn't say this stuff to me. Actually, this is... Actually, what causes all the problems is that I say this stuff to myself. Which should make you feel even worse for me. Don't you get it? It's so hard being a self-indulgent covert narcissist. It's so hard, guys. It's so difficult to always criticize yourself and secretly delight in the savory taste of feeling bad for yourself because you're self-critical. Don't you get that? Don't you get that? If you don't get it, you should. Grace is a victim of Grace Thorpe, SMH. This is Meredith. No. Who am I? Grace is the girl who you see on stream, but not this one. <clears throat> He's not texting me back, and it's been half an hour since we got in a fight. And it's never been that long before he texts me back. Uh oh. Here come the tears from baby. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. He doesn't want to listen to me complain anymore. Mm, that's not going to be good for my mental health. For my mental stability. I need someone to talk to. I need someone to complain to. Don't you get it? What the fuck? What am I supposed to do? Go find somebody else? I've spent all these years fucking manipulating him so that he copes for me perfectly every time I'm a bitch. And makes me feel better about myself. Don't you get it, guys? Don't you get it? And don't you also get the added layer of on top of all of this, I'm also a victim of my mom teaching me to do this to myself because what she calls being honest is really just being despairing about everything and saying that you're the worst person in the world, which is exactly what she did. And on top of that, don't you understand that I'm just like her? I'm just like my mother. I'm just like my mother. Which is what she used to tell me. You're just like me. You just think you're better than me. You're just like me. You're just like me. We've come full circle. Don't you get it? Feel bad for baby. Feel bad for baby. Feel bad for baby. Feel bad for baby. Feel bad for me. My mommy did that to me. Don't you guys feel bad? Don't you guys feel bad? Don't you feel bad for somebody whose mother did something, like, not cool? What do you mean most parents are off? What do you mean I'm lucky to have a dad who cares about me and wants me to succeed? What are you talking about? No, I'm a victim. He puts too much pressure on me. I'll just pretend like he doesn't, but give chat side eye. Right? What are you talking about? I should be grateful. Grateful? I should be grateful? Fuck you. Fuck you and your gratefulness. I'm not grateful for anything. I deserve way more. And you should be happy that I'm not angry about how little I've gotten.
over 100 viewers, she's loving it. All that matters. That's right, Quantum Epic. That's right. <sighs> Except I actually... I actually would be... Well, would I even care, really? I... Me and my dad got in a fight, and he hasn't responded in 40 minutes, and he's never taken this long to respond. So, there's two options. Either he's talking to somebody in the lobby here, and he got distracted, and he's like, you know what, fuck her, let her go, and spiral, and I don't care. She'll get over it. Or, he's purposefully ignoring me. He didn't block me. But he's, like, really, really fed up with me. In which case, I will be shattered. Am I probably, probably being too dramatic? Yes. Ben browsing Tinder right now. He's taking a shit. You're caring way too much about what he's doing. I know, but... I just like uh, uh. okay rerun stop it focus refocus different topic no we're not doing this we're not doing this how dare I show affection towards him it's just manipulative you're just manipulating people if you cared so much about him you wouldn't have fucking gone in a fight in the first place you fucking won <laughs> yourself. You're a lol cow. You're a lol cow. You're a lol cow for people online. You're a lol cow at 21. You're a lol cow. <clears throat> you're a lol cow. And the most lol cow-y thing about you is that you're aware. You're self-aware and yet you still keep doing it. Because that's, that's what lol cows are. They're people who are stuck in patterns that they'll never get out of. And all people want to watch them do is keep going back in the same patterns over and over and over again. Because it's funny. Because they're crazy. Because they're crazy. The definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting different results. And that's what law cows do. They do the same thing, same cope, same whatever cycle over and over and over and over and over again until they end up dying or leaving the internet and doing it privately because it's too embarrassing or whatever. Or they fix it, and then most of the time, if you get famous doing lol cow shit and you fix your life, you're no longer interesting. Nobody wants to watch. So that's the path. And there's nothing I can say that's going to... I mean, there probably is stuff I could say that would change it. But I don't care enough to say... Like, I don't... I've said it all... I've said it all so many times before. I don't know how I'm going to get out of this. I don't know. I got the Trump coat hands. It's huge. We're on the brink. Folks. You've never seen anything like it. Huge. Billions. I've said this billions and billions and billions of times. I need to pray. I need therapy. I need to figure out the stuff with my mom. I need to fight back against people who have done me wrong. Yada, 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 yada. I've done it a million times. So. Saying it again. Isn't going to change anything. And most likely, I'm being overdramatic. He will respond to me. I'll apologize. I'll say, like, you know what? I, I was, you know, that was overdramatic. I got it out of my system. I, I was... This is my latest cope. I needed to kind of, like... It's very subtle what I do. And I, this is a rerun, too, by the way. We've done this a million times. But it's like, I will push him away 
and not be nice while seeming like I'm being normal, but it's like very specific vibes. And he picks up on that and he's like, what are you doing? And I'm like, nothing, nothing. We're having a great time. And then I just like, won't respond when he asks me things or like, I won't tell him where I'm going and I'll like leave for 10 minutes. And I, it's just very subtle. It's very subtle because I'm very manipulative and I don't want him to know what I'm doing to him. And then eventually he'll be like, what the fuck? Why aren't you being nice? What's wrong with you? Are you mad about, like, what's going on? And I'm like, oh, what? What are you talking about? We're having a great time. I'm being normal. But I secretly know that I've been doing this stuff. And then he's like, well, you're, I, I, I feel like you're being, like, rude to me for some reason. I don't understand why. Why did it, like, why did it take you so long to do that? Why did you tell me if it would take you longer? Like, I was just sitting out here in the rain waiting for you. Oh, I, uh, I don't know. I just, I forgot. Sorry. I don't know what you're so upset about. It's just gaslighting. It's just gaslighting. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. So I'll probably be like, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. Like, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry. I will. You know, I, and he'll be like, I don't want to hear sorry. I don't want to hear you say sorry. Because that doesn't mean anything. You've said sorry so many times now. Like, I don't care if you're sorry or not. You probably feel sorry. But I want to know how you're going to fix that. Or if you don't want to do this anymore, then we can just split up. Just go our separate ways. You can have the channel, whatever. But like, I can't do this with you anymore, Grace. I can't do this level of drama. It can't be that every time that I say you're acting off, you, like, burst into tears and go non-verbal. It's a way of punishing me for telling you, for expressing my emotions to you, my feelings. It's a way of punishing me for doing that. It's not fair to me if, if I feel like you're not communicating with me. If I point that out to you, first you gaslight, and then when I point it out again, you burst into tears and you stop talking to me and you start treating me like you're afraid of me that's that's not fair that's punishing me your dad for communicating with you where was i going with this oh no chat has become ben <laughs> Grace acting for donuts. As soon as she gets the donuts, she cuts the live. What is that based off of? Oh, like last time when I got two $50 donuts and then I ended the stream after eight hours? Really? You're complaining about that? <laughs> I'm such a retard, dude. <sighs> He just texted me, come have breakfast. It's great. Uh. <laughs> I get so nervous. <laughs> this is what I'm embarrassed about. This is what I don't want to show people. I'm so clingy. <laughs> <laughs> Go down and have breakfast and get the fuck off social media. <laughs> well, this is what I'm afraid of people judging me for. Whatever, who cares? I got nervous that he was just sucking my shit. <sighs> okay, I'll be right down. <laughs> I'm streaming my... <sighs> what do you call this? My uh, breakdown right now. <sighs> Should I take this stream <coughs> down with me?